soccer? I'm so excited. I love SEC play. I think every single game is overly competitive. I think everyone brings their all to every single moment. Every single game to me feels like very like championship caliber. So I, I don't know. I love conference play. I'm very excited. Yep. Uh, speaking of championship caliber, what was the mindset like for you and then after the fact facing UNC on Sunday? Every game, I think I mentally approach the exact same. Obviously, when you're playing a team like UNC, there's a little more mental prep that goes into it, knowing how talented they are. But I think going into it, I think I played the same way I always do. I think the team showed up the same way they always do, and I think we rose to the occasion. Uh, what is your biggest goal as you start SEC play on Thursday? Um, I think my goal is always to impact the game however I can, whether that's an assist, a goal, um, something starting a play that results in a goal, I don't know, that's just always my intent. I think I go into every game like that. Um, I think I'll continue to go into every game like that, and especially with conference play, because it is just that much more important. Uh, Gianna, how do you feel to get uh, SEC Offensive Player of the Week? What does it do to your confidence? And how do you um, use that to boost yourself uh, moving forward? It's very exciting. I mean, it's very rewarding. I think it is a physical representation of how hard I've worked. But it is one thing that I take day by day. And like once it's over, just go into the next week. Because it is an honor of a week, you literally just keep moving on. So it makes me feel good. But I know there's still next week to come. Okay. Johnny, your team attempted 11 goals against North Carolina last week. Uh, what do you feel about the high offensive play that you guys have had, and how has your chemistry been kind of building in uh, this season? Chemistry has been great. I think it gets progressively better every single game. I think the more and more we work together as this new team kind of like gels, I think it really shows on the field, and I think we get those shots off, we get those opportunities, and I think we bring that same intensity to every game, and we kind of force it down the other team's throat that we are like on the attacking prowess, and I think it really shows. Um, Coach mentioned about whether you guys win or lose, you keep your composure and be yourself. What helps you personally get through that wall of anger and have that turned into energy to even scoring a goal and communicating with the team like you did in the 79th inning on Sunday? I'm like a very hard person on myself. I think when it comes to like me playing, I'm like my own worst enemy because I am so hard on myself. But I think especially with the UNC, I was literally just drilled in the back of my mind. I'm going to score. I'm going to score. I'm going to score. I think I tend to go into like games like that every single time, but against tougher competition, it feels like that much more intense. And I think, I don't know, I just use that as like intensity, as energy, and I put it back onto the field. How are you guys preparing for Georgia, and what's going to be the biggest challenge on the field Thursday? Um, I think we're preparing the exact same way we always do. Um, we kind of use the same tactics in practice no matter what team we play. doesn't matter whether it's an FSU, whether it's a Stanford, whether it's a Southern Miss, whether it's a Sanford, it really doesn't matter. It is every single game, it's the same intensity, it's the same level in practice, and it is that consistency that gets us to where we are on the field. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah. uh, Gianna, you guys enter SEC play as the number one ranked team in the conference, also as the reigning champions. Um, knowing that you kind of have that like target on your head, the teams you know, are looking up to try and beat you, does that affect your team's mindset mentality at all? Personally, it doesn't because honestly, it's just more exciting. I'd rather much be the person that's hunted than the hunter. I just think having that pedestal makes you feel like a physical representation of your hard work. So I think we've deserved that position. And I think playing those South Carolinas, playing those Georgias, those Arkansas, I think they deserve to be here just as much as we do. And I think rankings don't matter in that sense. Talk about some of the demands of SEC play. It's always touched on how physical it is and what it can take out of players. But just, just talk about some of that and how you're going to combat it once you actually get out on the field and face it. Oh, for sure. SEC, I think this is the conference where I just belong because I just love how intense, how physical it is. All the girls are literally putting their blood, sweat, and tears into every single game, which is why I feel like it's so much a championship mentality. Every single game is just as intense as the next. It doesn't matter what team you're playing. So I think mentally going into it, I, same thing, we just prepare the same way. Every single game is intense, every single game is super physically demanding, and I think that goes back into our recovery processes the days before, the days after. I think we just put in the same demand that we want out of it, and we come out successful.